Oh, how's it going? Have you made much progress on the visualization device? It's not done, if that's what you're asking. But it's going well, isn't it? No. No, it's not. I don't think I can do it. I can't get it finished. Why not? I don't know. I, I don't know. I probably don't even want to know. After that, Ray Ray made himself scarce for a while. He left Akihabara and left the DAB. So that visualization device was... Being developed because he wanted to know. He wanted to know if Mari Tojo was real, or just his delusion. But he couldn't get it working. And that was more than he could stand. So he had no idea what was real and what was delusion. Which means it's entirely possible that his beloved doesn't exist. There's not a man or woman alive who could bear that. But he came back. With all the rumors of the delusion contractor and the DAB on the move, it became possible for him to see her again. So he returned in the hopes of determining once and for all whether Mari Tojo was real or simply his delusion. That's the only thing keeping Ray Ray going these days. So when the Freedom Fighters disappeared right before his eyes... Exactly. Which is also why he acted so coldly towards you and your friends. Hold on. I think I'm missing a few links in this logic chain here. I think all of you hit him a little too close to home. You're all mirrors of his former self. He feared that you'd be overwhelmed by delusions, lose those close to you, and become obsessed like he did. And he desperately wishes not to see that happen to you. Think of it as his own unique brand of compassion. He's never really been one for tact or social graces, exactly. I can tell. If I know Ray Ray, he's still searching for his answer, even now. He intends to find it all by himself, without dragging anyone else in with him. Too bad. I'm going after him. Do you think you can find him? I think I can try. No matter the reason, he saved all our butts before. That's not delusion. That's fact. And what he's gone through seems like it's a lot worse than what we have. So I want to make sure he has help. Very well. If Saki and the others drop by, I'll let them know you're off to save the day. But please, give the search a little extra push for me. Not just for Ray Ray, but for the answer he seeks to. Don't worry. I will. a new delusion? That's just like him. No entrance yet, though. You? Oh, you were the boy who was with Reiji, were you not? Asahi. Asahi Tachibana. I'll be sure to remember that. Asahi Tachibana, I ask you, what does this look like to you? This? It looks like a delusion that's begun encroaching upon the town to me. So it's not real, then? No, it's a delusion. That much I can say for sure. But when a delusion materializes in the world of reality, does that not make it real? Is this a trick question? This delusion is now part of this reality. That is incontrovertible. But just think what good we could do if we were to learn to harness and control delusions like this one. But that's... At every drastic change in world history, there has been a delusion present. Well, 
sure, probably, but... But the heart of man is weak, and inconvenient realities are easy to shun. Just tell me what you're trying to say here. If only he had companions like your little group back then. What was wrong with the ones he had? Reiji suffered in silence, telling no one his plight. Unable to accept delusions, he averted his gaze from reality. Since then, he's been caught in the gap between fiction and non, cursed to live in fear of existence itself forevermore. Until today, that is. Until today? What are you planning on doing to him? Are you blind? Have you really not noticed? This delusion is Reiji's. What? It appears the data gathering has been successfully completed. A digital delusion proved too interesting to ignore. Fortunately, the range of his delusion's damage is very small. So we plan on using this opportunity to deal with him. You're going to nullify his delusion then? For his own good, yes. How do you know what's for Reiji's own good? That that's what he'd want? Destroying this delusion and everything that comes with it will free him of his fear. Of course he'd want that. You're just putting words into his mouth. As the director of the DAV, I'm prepared to take responsibility for my actions. And I'm prepared to take responsibility for mine. I won't let you destroy Reiji's delusion. Is that what he would want? You dirty little... If he sinks to the depths of despair, you'd best be prepared to drown down there with him. Huh? Ugh. Now's not the time to stand here staring like an idiot. I have to find Reiji and fast. Well, well, well. If it isn't Asahi. Hazuki? Where's the fire? You look like you're on the hunt for someone. Um, well? I see. So he's off on his own then. Knowing Reiji, he plans on trying to finish this all by himself. And if I can't find him, I can't stop him. Well, two heads are better than one. Perhaps the search would go smoother with someone else helping you out. You mean... you? Time out. Aren't you supposed to be resting? In a hospital or otherwise? Oh, no, I'm not talking about me. You already have a partner in crime. His name's Mizuki, remember? Uh, but Mizuki isn't here. That's true. He's probably off sulking by himself somewhere. I would be too. So why don't you go to him? Sorry? I'm certain he must be waiting for you. You really think so? Well, of course. He's not so childish that he won't be able to get back up after reality bops him on the nose. Happens to all of us. But he is a stubborn fool, like he's always been. And he never tells you what he's actually feeling. So even though he hasn't said it, I'm absolutely certain he's waiting for you, Asahi. I ask you, please go see him. But what do I say to him? I think you know. Huh? You'll figure it out when you get there, at least. You two have always been in sync that way. Always laughing and smiling together, and fighting, and growing up together as dear, dear friends. So I have every confidence that when you see him, you'll know what to say. You're really the only person who can reach him, I think. Huh. Have you remembered? Good. Then you know just as well as I do that you need to go see him. Get out of here and do it! Y yes ma'am! That's a good boy. Very Asahi of you, even. Good luck, and Godspeed. I swear, what will it take to pull that boy away from his big sister? Ooh. 